Hi, I'm Jonathan Matt Mendes, Painted Love, and I've teamed up with Dunelm to create some Christmas crafty projects. During the month of December, my dining table gets many incarnations. So I'm going to take you through two simple projects. One, an upcycling project using some old table mats. And the other is a decoration with candles and household mugs. So what you want to be doing with your table mat is taking a sanding block, take off any sheen and key up the surface. I'm going to be using um, craft glue, you could use PVA glue or many other different types of glue. This is a product that I've picked up from Dunelm. I'm going to just squeeze out into a bowl. Apply a generous amount of the glue. The softer the brush is, the better for this. And we're just going to give one coat all over and it will dry translucent. You need to repeat this process twice. Clean all of the edges of any surplus glue set to one side um, and then repeat the process. So the full set of mats have now gone um, transparent and ready to receive my gorgeous Dunelm wrapping paper. Cut a section ready to decoupage to the top of this table mat. Let's go. You can have quite a large overhang. We'll deal with that later. The glue is dried. We're going to place our recyclable paper on top of the glue face up and then we're going to use some parchment paper, baking paper, over the top of that and we're going to iron on the design. Take your really hot iron, firmly push down to the edges of the table mat. So there we have it, just two more easy steps to go and one of them is to remove the paper from the edges. Now you've got to be really careful with this. I'm going to be using a craft blade. So I'm holding the blade up against the board. So in, keep your fingers well away, nice and tight. I'm not going to worry about the corners too much because I can come back with a pair of scissors and tidy them up and we're good to go. All that's left to do now is give these table mats just two fine coats of Rust-Oleum Crystal Clear Protective Coat. Give the can a good shake, work in a well ventilated space, but use a mask, protect yourself, and just two fine mists over the surface. Allow that first one to dry and repeat, and you should have a beautiful finish. So whilst I'm waiting for my upcycled table mats to dry, I'm going to show you a quick and simple table decoration make. Um, I'm going to use a white mug, a white candle, because I think the two really pair up really gorgeous together. And you may be wondering why I have potatoes. Now the potato is to anchor the candle. All that you need to do is find a potato that fits nice and snug at the bottom of the mug. Take the uh, potato back out and then you need to use a apple corer right in the center of that, straight away in, twist around, take the plug out. So you should end up with a hole in your potato. That will now fit snugly to the bottom, straighten it all up, of your mug, like so. And then you can take your white candle. Now, um, these candles have got a chamfer to the bottom, so it should make it very easy just to carefully squidge it in. There you go. And you've now got a very strong base to your candle. You could also use a handful of nuts at this point to fill the bottom, but I'm going to use the gorgeous Dunelm uh, Mossy Roll. I think this is beautiful. So let's tip the nuts back out. And we're just going to take a section, cut a little half moon to one side, just literally in like so to make it look kind of rustic. And then cinnamon sticks, you could snap one in half. The smell's absolutely gorgeous. Just took a couple of them in, some nuts, just place them down the side. And there you are, good to go. Instant Christmas in a mug. So when it comes to laying my placemats and plates, I'm just going to layer up um, with a plate and we're going to go with a wonderful linen napkin and some greenery from the garden. 
And of course, some Dunelm baubles to add that sparkle and glitz. And we're going to also take a little bit of one of Dunelm's gorgeous foliages and we're going to snip that there. And I think this will tie in beautifully with the table mat. Just a sprig on there, all ready for that evening supper with the friend or family. What could be more inviting than a table that looks this good? Please do not leave your candles burning unattended. Now I'm going to go and enjoy my supper for two. So if you enjoyed today's projects, please like, comment and subscribe.